Hello friends, welcome to my YouTube channel. This is Ramana. Today I will show practically uh, to answer one important SQL question. It is how to get the first entrance from a table without using top class in SQL. So there are two ways to get the desired output. This is a very important entry question for any SQL developer question or data analyst question. So first method we use the set, record, set row count method. So if you want to change as per your requirement, if you want to get for top 20 records, you have to make this set row count on top of your query and afterward you have to again reset the set row count as 0. By default it is 0. As per your requirement you have to change and again reset. Now I will show. <coughs> this is my person data in sample database. There are 570 records are there in, the, in this table. Now I want to get on top mm, 10 records of the table. Top 10 records. For that by using the set, record, set row count method. I am I make the property as 10 for, first term, for getting the first 10 records. And uh, run this query you will get just um, 10 rows even though the, uh, the uh, table has 570 rows after making the row count as 10 you will get the set uh, row count as 10 rows but immediately if you run this query individually it will show again 10 rows so the, the, this is the problem with the set row count if you want to change them, if you want to run this query in separate window, you will get 570 records. So in this window, you cannot get the complete data because of changing the set record as 10. So immediately, whenever you use the set record method, after executing this query, immediately you make it again. You you reset the property as 0. It will, it, it, it will show 10, 10 rows, but if you, if you run this query individually, it will show 570 records. Even though if you uh, remove these two properties and uh, run this query, so it will get 500 records. So by using set count method, you will get uh, desired output top 10 records top of the records in this case we do not use any top class in, in, in this query and second method i use here is the row, row num function in the same database i am taking as a i am using a row number function row number is one of the windows function it will assign the value in sequence will it is assign the numbers to sequentially as per your requirement over and i am matching the order by class order by here id order by id as ronam uh, here uh, ronam is alias name comma star so if you if if you execute this query, every row as uh, every ID as displayed, you uniquely uh, displayed one uh, sequential number. From there are 570 records, you will get 570 row numbers. Up. So this is how you need to get, get the uh, row number. But here we want top 10 records. Top record for getting top 10 records, you do not uh, directly write the where, where condition where ronum ronum is equal uh, ronum less than 11 like that. If you mention like this, it will throw error. That is, it was the invalid column because ronum is just the alias name. It's not the original column name. For that, you need to make, you have to 
make is make it as sub query and mention it as a temp table sorry one table one derived table one derived table name here on top of it you need to write select star from select star from where here row num less than 11 so if you execute this one we already show the um, sequential generating number from 1 to 570 by applying the row number function now in very condition we want just 11 records less than 11 that is 10 here just 10 records there so this is how you need to get the uh, top 10 records top 20 records without using the top class in both these cases we haven't used any top class uh, to get the desired result i will paste the uh, both queries here in the, de in the description box hope this video is useful to you to know how to write the top from 10 records by using without using the top class thanks for watching the video thank you very much